Hi everybody, here is Elizabeth from elizabethhallman.com. Uh, today I want to show you another new plugin which I've just discovered through a colleague at Empower Network, Miss Danny. Uh, now it's a very nice uh, plugin. It's called um, the Easy Shortcut co uh, Buttons. Uh, basically, uh, let me just show you how it looks like when, when you've done it. I've just I've not used it on a, a post which I've, I intend to do that. Uh, so this tutorial will be accompanied with a post. Uh, now, if I just go into preview, you're going to see what I mean. Yeah, basically it looks like this. Now I have three buttons. Uh, let me just get rid of that for the time being. I've got three different buttons because I've got three different. Uh, Pro, uh, actually three different membership programs that people can join so for each link you are going to land into a different uh, you know program uh, that you want to join so uh, basically what happens is uh, if you don't know how to do that you go in first and install the plugin now I'll just collect the button I won't install it but I will just show you how to if you're, if you're new at WordPress, how you do the new plugin, installation of new plugin. You go in and add new, and I'll just put in this title that is Easy Short Code Buttons and uh, Search. So, this is the Easy Code Search Buttons. It's really rated uh, pretty well there, so it should be actually okay for, for your website. And also very easy to, to work around. Uh, now I have installed it, so you just say install and activate it so that you have it running. And to do the settings, you go into the settings, <laughs> and there it is easy button customs. Now I've not done much here. I just left it like that. What I did basically is I went into uh, a blog post because when you when you install it, you're going to see that it comes on your main on your menu uh, buttons as a button here. So uh, there it is. This is the new button that comes in. So once you install it, you go in and also look at your blog post, and uh, basically it's just a, a mouse click. So what I what we're going to do is to, uh, if I did, you know, like uh, just press that, and it will just give me the formula there. Now this is the raw form. Uh, you have to, you know, put on all those, uh, all these buttons. You have to fill them in. Now let me jump back to the plugin and we go in and uh, do the settings which is going to take us outside the web my, uh, the back office easy customs yeah leave this page so it says to create your own buttons by including the css here visit this page uh, that is the alexthron.com so once you land there, what I did is I went in here and uh, picked up some simple formula that they have there. And so you go to the easy shortcut button, which is going to be, you know, there. So it, it tells you actually uh, briefly exactly what happens, you know, that you're going to see it there once you've downloaded it but this is the list of options that I found interesting so what I did I just copied all this and I came back to my post so I just put in a new post and then I dropped them there and when I go in here, press that, I'll get that uh, running. So what happens is that the URL, the link is here. So between the two quotation marks, you can pick up your link, which I have 
always in my editor so I can just go in the editor and since I'm promoting in power network so we have actually four four products right now so I copy that and I will drop it here right between you know right between the the quotation marks so when you see the color then they say default red blue yellow green white I guess you can choose whichever you want but then if you just go there then you say default and then you can choose your colors so you you put that that um, sign and that sign is the STGR and ALT ALT and on uh, I'm not sure I've got a German keyboard but on your left hand side where you have the sign greater than and less than you're going to see that you know this horizontal uh, bar sign this one here so you just press the you just press your two the STGR key and the ALT key and then press that and it should come out so um, and then make a space and go I just do it exactly how it is or you can just actually just copy this for the sake of this tutorial I just copy this all of it and what I will do is I just drop it exactly again between the quotation marks right there so that is done then shapes I just decided I didn't want it rounded so I said squared squared and the size I said I don't like it small so I said large and the alignment I called it I just tried centered or centered let's just use that then to replace this is what you know you want to say sign now, buy now, um, access now, whatever. So I just wrote join now. Yeah, and that's just about it. So I'll just get rid of that for the time being. Just in case I need it again. So when you go in and do the review, preview, Okay, let's just give it a title first. Uh, button. When we do a preview. <clears throat> just give it a second. So there it is. and there you are all in white so you have to change your colors uh, whichever you want but this is how basically it looked like uh, if you want to you know like uh, highlight in that you can use the bolt uh, by here join now um, bolt so again you can just go in and do again another preview and you'll see it gets bold so I guess you can also change the size if you want um, I'll just, I'll just give it a shot there and we can change the size there okay let's just give it a head up <gasps> no it doesn't work paragraph so let's just, just be okay there yeah, or you can, I think, change also the color here. I mean, you can just, let's say, let's have a look if it does change. There you are. So you can play around with it. Hope it's uh, been some use of use to you. Uh, if you need some more information, as usual, please visit my website at elizabethholloman.com where you're going to get more information on how to use the button. So, thank you for now and bye.